Hello and welcome to another episode of The Average EV. Today I'm going to be showing you how to add the NAX adapter within the Google Maps setting for your GM vehicle. Let's get into it. All right, everybody. So on Twitter, Nebula let me know that this had changed. I have been monitoring it within the Chevy Equinox EV, but I did not catch this. So uh, Nebula let, let me know and I was able to go check it out and kind of put this video out to show you all how to do it. Just in case you didn't know, A, you could do it or that you had to do it. So let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and take, take a look at this footage and see what you need to do to set things up within your Equinox EV. And I'm assuming this would be the same in the Blazer and the Silverado and the Lyric. So if you test this out on any of those vehicles, just leave it down in the comments that it works so people know. Well, let's get into the video here. So as you can see, here's the infotainment screen. I'm in Google Maps. You're going to click on the lightning bolt within Google Maps, which shows you all your charging stuff. Then you're going to click on the settings button there. And then you'll see something that says compatible plugs. Click that. And now you have a little slider where you can toggle on NACS, N-A-C-S, North American Charging Standard. Then you can go back. And you're going to want to make sure you set this to 150 or faster because superchargers are technically 250. So if you do 350, they won't show up. And then for, th for this purpose of this video, I have Electrify America and Supercharger, but later I actually take Electrify America off to kind of test something out. But now here you can see it says NAX adapter required, and you can now navigate to them. It is my understanding that if you navigate to them now, you will be able to actually precondition. So here I did a fake little trip to Walt Disney World just to see if it would add the Tesla superchargers to the trip. And unfortunately, what I found out was it won't add them to the trip yet. So here you see me clicking, looking at all the stops. And right now I have it set just to use Tesla superchargers and none are showing up. So for some reason, Google Maps doesn't think that I can go to a Tesla supercharger at this point in time. I'm sure that they'll fix this, uh, but as of right now, for me, when I tested it today, which is September 30th, 2024, uh, it wasn't working. So this is really great that now you can find them much more easily and that you can at least navigate to them. Hopefully Google will fix things so that it will actually add it to the route plan uh, that way people can enjoy the Tesla supercharger network and that the car will automatically take them to the ones they need on their route. So I hope you all found this video helpful. Um, if anything changes and you, you find that it starts routing for you, uh, it will route you to Magic Doc. I do want to let everyone know. So I'm only talking about non-Magic Doc locations. But if for some reason it starts to um, route for you, please put that in the comments so that I can put a note as to when that occurs. But like I said, as of today, that is not working, unfortunately. So thanks again for watching. If you haven't already, please remember to give a like, a subscribe, hit that notification bell, and I will catch you all next time.